Dragon Dead, everybody! Woo! Man, you're enjoying that Ghost Rider so much, aren't I you? I am. Such a nice figure. Like, you're glad you picked it up? Yep. And I know it's not gonna happen for, like, at least another week. With Toys R Us going out of business, because that's where we picked it up from. Yes, is I'm kind of, like I don't want to sound like a terrible person. I'll wait for Toys R Us to go out of business, but I kind of am, so I can like stock up on Legos, which is gonna be a smart thing. That's like investing your money in gold. Well, per. But you don't plan to like resale, so it's not. I'm not a terrible person. Yeah. Right? Yep. Because if I did it for resale, would I be a terrible person? Probably. A golden turn up is all you needed. Yep. So I could get more power moons. Why don't you get it right now rather than like going in a circle? I was collecting the purple coins on the other side of it. You ever follow me doing that? Yes. Alright, get this power moon. Yeah! We can buy our way into society. How's that, Layla? I don't think Layla understands how money works. The chef hat. If I buy that beret and only put it on him with his regular clothes, Mario looks like such a tool. I can believe it. I showed you that, haven't I? Yeah. I do believe it, right? Of course I do. You saw it from her hand, right? Yes. I think the one thing I don't like, and this is just me nitpicking the figure, is that you need to have the kickstand down at all times. Because then... Like an actual motorcycle. It flops It on. doesn't balance. Uh, kickstand! Kickstand! But it looks really nice, you can't deny that. No. Yeah! Let's make some soup! Mario is a soup. I'm a soup! <laughs> I'm a super soup! Aha! Get it! I made a funny! Ah! Dang it! Damn you run tomatoes! You lied to me! You told me all Marvel movies are the greatest thing ever! Really, Mario? Wow, how is that thing, like, not spilling over? Answer me. I would like to. Right, me. <laughs> yeah, more super soups. Give me it. Give me the su secret ingredients. Man, that thing is gonna now taint the soup. That soup is gonna be like pure evil now. Yep, and it's all Mario's fault. Hey, don't kick our currency around! We what? need those cans! Your, that's not your currency. Your currency is these little purple coins. Man, can you imagine if like, Mario just like kicked around? Like someone's currency? Like that? Yeah. You're like, hey, I have no respect for other people's cultures! <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Mario doesn't. Oh, that's so funny. I forgot what we were talking about earlier today, how we were talking about, like, Rebels and Clone Wars really have no regard for canon. And then we were talking about the rule of two, remember? And why there's only two Sith at a time? Yeah. They and said, and said because they have that tendency of betraying each other, right? Yeah. Like, Shock T said it in the Forest Unleashed, like, the Sith always betray one another. But you'll find that out soon enough. And it doesn't matter if it's the master of an apprentice betraying the secret apprentice or... Vice so versa. Someone betrays... Somebody some betra gets betrayed, leaving a void in the system. Because we were saying that 
Because you probably that you didn't know that or Palpatine took over or killed Plagueis. Yeah, I thought like Palpatine killed Plagueis. Like before like, episode one, huh? Yeah, but no, he killed him during episode one. That's so insane. Like, how can you not find that insane? I mean, what I found out, I thought that was pretty crazy. Then it's like, um, nope. You die now. And then... It's just so insane that Sith are like, I must become stronger than my master, so I'm gonna need... Your help. Your to do help it. to do it, and I, in turn, you will become my apprentice. And they don't necessarily pick someone who's. They don't pick a friend. They like pick somebody that like is powerful enough to do it on the together, right? Yes. Like they're like, I see great potential in this person. You would be my apprentice. And that's what. What's it called? He saw in. Palpatine. Not Palpatine, but in Maul, huh? Yeah. Because he loved Maul's just like pure aggression. And just like Maul is just a living being of hate. I told you like in some of the Legends comics he actually took Force Lightning and kept charging yeah. the person who hit him with it. Yeah, because... You don't do that if you're like just a regular being. You do that... When you're nothing but hate and malice. Oh, that's attack. Like you said, Darth Maul is just like... All is pure hate. That's why he would have been like a perfect Sith. Now granted, you said Although he could have learned... Although a lot of people consider him like just a Sith... A, uh, and a, and a, sa a Jedi hunter. Well, I just killed another Goomba. Like, he's not really... A true, a true Sith. Sith, he's just a Jedi hunter. Or someone even say he's an assassin. Not necessarily an apprentice. Cause Ventress was nothing more than an assassin. Yeah. Cause Sith assassins are completely different than Yeah, they assassinate Sith. I thought they would they just assassinate whoever their Well not necessarily master, but Can I we just say the love master? Before I continue this, I just love how Hammer Bro has like rad hairstyles. Can we like just take a moment to appreciate the, the, the Hammer how much, Bros? How much personality they have? Yeah. And that's why you like them so much, right? Yes. That's why Dad likes them too. Yeah, our dad is like one of the biggest fans of the Hammer Bros. And it's all thanks to Mario Baseball. Like, how can you not like these guys? Oh, you son of a bitch snuck up on me. You saw him coming, didn't you? Yeah. I'm, I would, I'm surprised like you didn't even see him coming. I didn't think he was going to reach me, that's why. But yeah, I was also like learning up on how Palpatine trained Darth Maul in like, all seven forms of lightsaber combat. Yeah. And that he w he wanted him to master the seventh form. Wasn't it just because of how aggressive he is? Yes. Kind of like how Darth Maul, or how Obi Wan mastered. He didn't master the second form. He is mastery of the second Who, form. Obi Wan. Yep. Where's the other one? I know it's hidden under something. In fact, I think it's over here. In what's it called? Uh, what is it? Mace Windu even says like Obi Wan didn't just master the second form; he is the mastery of the second form. Oh, it's over there. What is it? Watch. There, there we go. go. Yeah, yeah! You did it! And I'm not being sarcastic this time, you actually did it! 
Yay! Search and excavate the cheese rocks. Wow, look at that. We're at 10 minutes already. So when we come back... More Mario Odyssey! Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before we go, can we talk about how much of a debacle Clone Wars was with having two pairs of Sith? How, how bad that is. It wasn't really a debacle. It was like Maul took on his apprentice. He really wasn't a Sith anymore because he got shunned. And then Palpatine had Dooku. And then Palpatine learned of... His second lightsaber, and he's all, all right, now it's time. And then he just goes and fucks shit up using not his standard seventh form, but the fifth form, That's what which was surprising. Because the Emperor doesn't use a fifth form normally, and the Emperor hates lightsabers in general. He does, but anyway, uh, when we come back, more Mario Odyssey. Let's Take care, everyone. Bye. Man, they are really trying their hardest to get you. I know. I think they've... Look, they've even break some of the cheese box. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Apple! Ah! Oh, damn it! <laughs> Take care, everyone.